and then the second group of people who deserve our zakah are the l'amilin. So we said that this brother, he gave three million pounds of zakah. And he said to this person that you know the situation of the poor people in your locality. So you go take this zakah and go distribute it to them. So this person, he kept two million in his pocket and the remaining million from the three, he began to distribute to the poor. And when we asked him, that why did you not give the full three million? Why did you give the two? Why did you give one million and save the two million in your pocket? He says that I am from those people who are tasked with distributing the zakat. Don't you recite the Quran? So the meaning of wala amilina alayha are those people who have been tasked and made responsible with the collection and the distribution of zakat are those people who have been appointed by the state, the Muslim state. Like the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he sent Mu'adh ibn Jabal radiallahu an, and he appointed him as the collector and the distributor of zakah. So those people are deserving of zakah as well. However, if a wealthy person, he appoints a person personally to go distribute zakah, then he does not come under this category. Unless the wealthy person from his own money and not from his zakah, he gives him some wealth.